gravity turn. Altitude convergence, the radar has locked on the ground. Yes. <laughs> Lander separation commanded. Altitude 600 meters. 300 meters. 200 meters. 80 meters. 60 meters. 50 meters, constant velocity. 37 meters. 30 meters, 20 meters, 17 meters, standing by for touchdown. Touchdown confirmed. <laughs> Subsonic speeds and the heat shield has been separated.
Pod to conduct the Sky Crane maneuver. Sky Crane maneuver has started. About 20 meters off the surface. We're getting signals from MRO. Tango Delta. Touchdown confirmed. Perseverance safely on the surface of Mars. Ready to begin seeking the sands of past life. The descent stage has flown away to a safe distance. Perseverance is continuing to transmit direct through Marathon Orbiter to Earth. Just flight control, confirming that we have BVRs from Ingenuity. Ingenuity is reporting having performed spin up, takeoff, climb, hover, descent, landing, touchdown and spin down. And al altimeter data confirm that Ingenuity has performed its first flight, first flight of a powered aircraft on another planet. We have the tone for burn cutoff on Delta B. Roger, don't move, Juno. Juno, welcome to Jupiter. CNDH reports nominal status. Our SSR pointers are where we expect them to be, which means we have reported the expected amount of data. Oh. Copy that. Looks like we have a good data report. Mom, this is GNC on Pluto One. Go ahead, GNC. Uh, GNC is nominal. All hardware is healthy, and we have a good number of thruster counts. Copy that. GNC <laughs> is healthy. Mom, this is propulsion on Pluto One. Go ahead, prop. Propulsion is nominal. Tank pressure is 176.8. Copy that. A ton, a propulsion system is nominal. Hopefully, if things go well today, this will be the last astronaut you'll see uh, climbing into a vehicle to go fly in space on the shuttle. This is the NTD conducting the launch status check. Verify ready to resume count and go for launch. OTC. OTC is go. TBC. Tank and booster go. TTC. TTC is go. LPS. LPS is go. Houston flight. We're ready to go. Go for main engine start. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7. Six, five, all three engines up and burning. Two, one, zero, and liftoff, the final liftoff of Atlantis on the shoulders of the space shuttle. America will continue the dream. Roger roll, Atlantis. Houston now controlling the flight of Atlantis. The space shuttle spreads its wings one final time for the start of a sentimental journey into history. 24 seconds into the flight, roll program complete. Atlantis now heads down, wings level on the proper alignment for its eight and a half minute ride to orbit. Four and a half million pounds of hardware and humans taking aim on the International Space Station. 40 seconds into the flight, the three liquid fuel main engines throttling back to 72% of rated performance in the bucket, reducing stress on the shuttle as it goes transonic for the final time. 
Engines now revving up, standing by for the throttle up call. Atlantis, go at throttle up, no action, DPDT. Go at throttle up, no action on DPDT. Atlantis traveling almost 2,600 miles an hour, 21 miles in altitude, 24 miles downrange. Standing by for solid rocket booster separation. Booster officer confirms staging a good solid rocket booster separation. Guidance now converging. The main engine steering the shuttle on a pinpoint path to its preliminary orbit. Two minutes, 20 seconds into the flight. Atlantis already traveling 3,200 miles an hour, 35 miles in altitude, 50 miles downrange. Standing by for main engine cutoff. Booster officer confirms main engine cutoff. For the last time, the space shuttle's main engines have fallen silent as the shuttle slips into the final chapter of a storied 30-year adventure. Now standing by for external tank separation. standing group of professionals, the most dedicated launch team of technicians and engineers anywhere in the world. And the United States owes you a deep, a deep bit of thanks. And uh, I want to thank you for your service to our country. Thank you for uh, your service to NASA and the Kennedy Space Center, to the shuttle program. And most of all, thank you for this outstanding ride that we have had for the last 30 years aboard a United States Space Shuttle. You guys are absolutely the best. Thank you.